Hey everybody, today we'll be taking a look at Alien Isolation on the PlayStation 4. So, another Aliens in Space game. Let's just try the game. Uh, I should just have a start game. Ah, I don't have the camera connected. But that's interesting. So apparently if you move, the camera shows you moving. I don't have the camera, so it doesn't matter in here. That's particularly funny. Not very helpful for a Let's Play, but the idea that if I'm talking or making noise that that could draw enemies toward me, that's pretty cool. Uh, unfortunately for the Let's Play, that won't work very well. Absolutely doing novice, because of course I am. Collect blueprints to help Ripley. I don't know too much about this game. I've always been a big fan of the Alien series, but from what I understand, you control Ripley's daughter in this game. So we'll see how it goes. Hopefully better than Dead Space 2. That did not go so well for us. Final report of the commercial starship Nostromo. Third officer reporting. The other Hi, members Ripley. of the crew. Kane. Lambert. Parker. Brett. Ash. And Captain Dallas. Are dead. Cargo and ship destroyed. I should reach the frontier in about six weeks. With a little luck, the network will pick me up. This is Ripley. Last survivor of the Nostromo. Signing off. Strictly punch you in the mood, doesn't it? Ripley? I'm Samuels. I work for the company. It's about your mother. We think we may have found her, Amanda. A commercial vessel, the Anisadora has recovered what we believe to be the flight recorder unit of the Nostromo. Where? Zeta Reticula. What did it tell you? We don't know. The unit was taken to Sevastopol Station. It's proprietorial material, so the company wants it to be collected as soon as possible. Sevastopol's a supply depot in the region. It's a... Uh, Permanent freeport. I know facility. what it is. Transit's arranged. There's a courier ship called the Torrens heading out that way in two days. We're going to travel out. We? Oui. Me and another exec. And you, if you're willing. Look, Ripley, when this job came across my desk, I read the case history. I know why you're working in the region where she went missing. You're still looking, aren't you? I've been cleared to offer you a place on the Torrents if you want to come along. Maybe there'll be some closure for you. This is one of those don't do it, don't do it moments, but 
Yeah, if you didn't do it, then there wouldn't be a game. Oh, time for me to move. Okay. Sign in. I do like all the old DOS style prompt. They really tried to keep it looking in the same universe as the original Alien. Get dressed. Alrighty. Oh, I love these hallways. So I have a locker. Alright, here we go. Yay, objective completed. We got clothes on. That's not doing much. Oh, well, taking a shower after I got dressed, but whoops. Oh, the emergency phone. It's kind of like in Bioshock. Oh, there was no data to override what it's talking about. Alright, there we go. Now this is how you start a horror game. Let you get used to the environment, the controls, not just something jumping out at your face, trapping you in a room full of monsters that you don't know how to escape because you haven't learned how to move a character yet. Wow, that's great. It's got that same samurai style. This was done really lovingly to the original Alien. I always feel like I'm going to bump my head on these little beams. Oh, look at person. Ah, oh, Ripley. Samuels, did you wake up early? Well, I don't really need as much sleep as the rest of you. I was just inspecting the Torrens facilities, a well-maintained ship. I realize it's a very similar model to... The Nostromo. You will grow yes. it? M-Class. A later pattern, but close in spec. I've worked engineering jobs on ships like this. Of course. Is Taylor up yet? She's not a seasoned traveler. Hypersleep may have been punishing for her. Haven't seen her. I'll go check on her. Well, I thought I was the only one who was still asleep. So I'm gonna just keep walking around. I'm pretty sure this is where I came from, but maybe I'm supposed to go backward. Okay. Nobody else in here. doesn't help. Okay, back to wandering around aimlessly. Yeah, 
Okay, so this lets me sneak. Need to figure out the controls. This is where that... Oh, maybe not. I thought that's where the android guy was. There's a ladder, but it's got crap in the way. Oh, I mean, that's the person I'm looking for. Taylor, good morning. Ripley, it's certainly not good. I very much doubt it's morning either. Sorry. I feel like death. I don't know how you people put up with hypersleep regularly. You get used to it. I don't do long haul very often. Most legal execs don't travel further than the coffee machine. I'm surprised Raylan Yutani felt the need to send legal at all. The loss of the Nostromo and its cargo cost the company a lot of money. It's important we find out what happened. If I can close the case with a conclusive accident report, it'll look great with my superiors. I'm sorry, that was insensitive. I realize your mother has been missing for 15 years and, and you... It's okay. We'll both get what we want, mm. right? Uh, well, we're definitely not gonna find her then. He's probably been up for hours. Looks like we're up. Are you Samuels? I guess not. Old school style, the, the blinking is a lights. Very good order for an old M -class captain. She was a wreck when I bought her. Took a few years and a lot of contracts to refit. She pays for herself now. You said we're approaching Sevastopol Station. Are we docking? I believe your contact is Marshal Waits, is that right? I'll hail Sevastopol and arrange boarding with him. Good. Let's get this done. Don't worry, Miss Taylor. Routine. In and out. Connor, how we doing? SMG loaded and calibrated. Approach mm -hmm. vector locked. Prep comm so I can say hello. Channel open, Captain. Does everyone have their briefing document? You can watch the approach on the monitors. Can I? Well, I'm not sure which monitors you're referring to. Switch to monitors. Sevastopol Station. Is that damage? It looks like damage. Punch up 74, tight angle. Looks like the dry dock bay is screwed. I can't bring the Torrens into that. This is a commercial vessel, Torrens out of St. Clair, registration number MSV7760, calling Sevastopol traffic control. We're carrying three passengers on a whale and Yutani Bond. You're holding the Nostromo flight recorder unit. We request immediate permission to transfer the passengers portside over. <laughs> Hello, Marsha? 
Mar Marshal, this is the Torin. Say again. They said lockdown. You think you, if nothing else, that would be enough to not up. land? So I fitted Samuel's suit with a radio booster. I can only keep the Torrens in transit for 24 hours. You'll have heard from us by then. Safe trip. Stand by. My contract doesn't cover bloody spacewalks. It's the only option. And it's perfectly safe if you do what I tell you. <sighs> Famous last words. Depressurizing. Oh, fuck. Hating this. Just shout on me, Taylor. You too, Samuels. Affirmative. Like we shouldn't have done this. Samuel! Taylor! Respond! Anybody! Interesting. Kind of giving some spoilers down at the bottom, but also kind of helping you out. So despite being called Alien Isolation, there are, are the people still here, which is a little surprising. I didn't think you, you didn't think you'd have any company. Oh, good. Was that my broken helmet? Oh, it was just dirty. And of course, I think Samuel had the radio, so I can't just call for help. she's taking off the suit, but I don't know if I agree with the logic behind that. The spaceship's kind of falling apart. Oh, well, that's interesting. It says the registration points will warn you if there's enemies nearby. Make sure I go over. Because by default it says, do you want to save? No. I quite understand why they do that. Oh. <laughs> Shit. So I'm guessing I'm not going that way. I still have several buttons that I don't know what they do yet. I know this button, R3 makes me sneak. Okay, it looks like L3 is running.
Holding down B does something, but I don't know what that UI menu is. Oh, good. We're gonna go through a vent. I didn't like it. I think it's dark. Guess we're going this way. Nope. Oh, good. It's just a series of bad decisions. God damn. I will say I definitely like the slower approach. For a horror game, it's much more successful at building the tension. I can definitely see why people might not like the slow burn. But I think it's much more effective. Okay, don't know what that is, but found something. Maybe I wasn't supposed to get one here. There's nothing here. Jeez, how long has it been bad? Sort of the interesting thing about the leaping animation that they go into in this universe is you know you have communication with the place and then you set out and then months or possibly years pass between the trip so by the time you get there it's really unclear you know how long time has passed So there's some kind of crafting mechanic in this game because I keep finding just scrap parts. Hello? Anyone here? Nope. Okay, so I don't have the option to yet, but I can fix up the place. Or at least to power a door. Doesn't anything here oh, okay. work? Sorry, I really didn't mean to cut you off. That's another little widget from the movie. Again, whoever made this game, I think it was Sega, they did a really nice job. I killed the power.
Okay, no explanation. Oh, another save point. This is my third save point then, and I still haven't come across any creatures. Again, much slower burn. Though it looks like I did take some damage, probably from the scripted sequence when I fell. I came from. Yeah. Looks like it wants me to do something over here. It's very quiet, mostly just ambient noise. Alright, let me look at this terminal again. Restore power. Oh, there we go. Oh, there's people again. Not sure what sound it came or which direction the sound came from, but I heard somebody. I've got to at least play till I see a xenomorph. The hell happened here? Even when I'm running, I still feel like I'm moving very slowly. Okay, so I need an item for that door. This is all walled off. There's some stairs. Door's locked. Okay, let's go upstairs. Is that my ship? The torrents. I'm here. I'm right here. We're lame. Yeah, I don't think they'll be able to see me. God damn it. Considering what this place looks like, I'm a little surprised we actually heard from anybody at all when we tried to ask. When we tried it when we first radioed them, we did have somebody respond, but I heard someone and I tried going what I thought was the right direction and there's nobody here, so maybe I went the wrong way. But there is nothing up here. I guess maybe I was just supposed to see my ship. I can go this way. What's that? Power? Yay, power. an arcade machine? Yeah, it looks like an arcade machine. Oh, the door opened. Ooh, maybe that's why they killed the power. Oh, I'm probably messing things up then by turning power back on, aren't I? That's interesting to think about. Maybe they killed the power to try to keep the 
the alien traps in a specific area, and by just turning everything on, I am just messing up everybody's plan. Or something. Julia Jones, today's update. After numerous demands, Marshall Waits finally called a public meeting to address the rumors that have been circulating on Sevastopol. But instead of the answers we wanted, he continued to be evasive, and after only a few minutes, he and his team were pelted by projectiles from an angry crowd. A gun was fired, there was panic, and now Waits and what's left of his team are forcibly ejecting us from the terminal. Feels like we're on our own now. Okay, I just found a little vent. I'm not sure if I was supposed to go that way or not, but I did. damn place is falling apart. Said use. Okay. Am I really gonna crawl through this? Oh no, this is a bad idea. Why am I doing this? Mm, I don't like it. So we do have the outsider's perspective of knowing about the xenomorphs because from her perspective, this is just like what is going on. Oh look a person. A back friend. I need friends. Ooh, lots of corpses. This is a fun it's room to be, be in. Exit up ahead. I saw somebody. I just want a friend. Let's see what other areas of the ship we can give the Xenomorph to by powering up all the doors. Yay, another generator. Alright. Button mashing time. I really do suspect that that's the reason why the power was killed, and then I really am just messing things up. Ooh, interesting. This is the door I was trying to get through. Our safe point. Chris, it's Turner. Gotta deal with that wasted asshole again. This time he nearly wrecked the door with a maintenance jack. Guess he figures it's safe here. Wants to lock himself in. Screw him. We got too much to worry about without babysitting drunks. Anyway, I 
left room in the evidence lockup. Let the son of a bitch sleep it off. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, every time I come across a specific door, it tells me I need that tool to get through. But I have not found that yet. Definitely getting a lot tenser. And I kind of get the impression that we're going to be having to deal with as many dangerous people as the xenomorph itself. So what got him, if he was in this room, locked alone? I mean, it's possible that it could have been a xenomorph, but I don't think it would have left him, or had would have just killed him, so that seems more like a person did that. Be heavy. She picks that up pretty easily. All right, let's see what. Oh, there's another ID. Somewhere. Interview subject. Heist. Did I say that right? Heist. Look, if you can't even tell me your name, we're gonna be here a hell of a long time. I just want to know about your boss. He's got you all into a lot of trouble. Someone's gonna be accountable. I'm gonna make damn sure someone's accountable. No? Tough guy, huh? Turn up, turn off the tape. Ew, cool. Maybe our friend here is just shy. Well, that's gonna come into play. Needing to be able to hide. Alright, time to get out of here. Now, I did see a person run in here. But I guess I couldn't have caught them because they were gone, like, immediately. Stay still. Okay. Finally found a friend. Come on! I'm Ripley. Where'd you come from? Ripley! Off station. A ship. There's no ships! Here! There are now. Well, huh, that's good news. Because things are not so good here. Something blew just now. Rocked this whole place. I saw it. Lady, that 
that's the least of our problems. Yeah? Yeah. Something's on this station. Something you wouldn't believe. Like what? A killer. You get it? Okay. I know this guy's a little crazy, but like, obviously I'm not a threat. Axel. I was boarding with two colleagues. EVA. We got separated by the blast. Can you help me find them? Why? Because you seem to know your way around. No, I mean, why? What's in it for me? A place on the ship. How did I know I can trust you? I need to find comms. I need to contact my ship. That was an unanswer. This is your lucky day. Let's go, sweetheart. Seeks and comms is in the Sistex Bayer. It's quite God. a distance, but we can get to a transit through the freight area. But watch yourself. We can get into all sorts of trouble there, okay? Yeah, I kind of need more detail than that. Like, clearly, Come you could on, give I me more information than long. just, there's a killer here. Was that you following me back there? I had to keep my distance. Can't take any chances. Stick close to me. What? Who are you? I'm John. Uh, this is Ringo. Immediately We're lost him. Assholes. We haven't got time for this. Come on, Jana. Oh, there he is. Jeez. Don't tell them anything. Look, I've got the elevator working. Jana, let's go. Okay? I, I'm sorry. Good luck. Okay. What the hell was that about? Why are you so damn aggressive? Everyone's running shit scared. Keeping to their own. Safer that way. Not really. Safety in numbers. But I don't know what happened on this ship. I'm guessing a bunch of jerks ship of messed it up. Reveal McCoy. Hold up. Let me get the elevator. Allow me. Place is old. Needs a special touch. Okay. Well, what are you waiting for? Hit the button. You threw a fit about how you wanted to do it. Now you're yelling at me to push the, the button. Noise down here. There might be people around. I'd appreciate it if you told me what the hell was going on right now. Yeah, Listen. seriously. When we get to the ship, we can kick back, braid each other's hair, and chat all you want. Yeah, when we get to my ship, I need to know what's going on right fucking now. Fine. Like I said, there's a killer. A killer? What does that even mean? I ain't seen it, but it's here. Picking us off one by one. What are you saying? A psycho? A person? No, something else. Monster. Yeah, why didn't you start with that word? Monster is a bit more descriptive than Oh, it's a killer. Oh, it's a killer, it's gonna get ya. Shit. We need to move. This way. Get down. Yeah, I don't know how he can't see me. I am right in front of his face. Did anyone else catch that? Go on. Go. We've warned you. Get back. Uh-oh. I wasn't doing anything. Trouble. We'll have to go around them. Follow me. That was crap. I was getting shot for no reason. Okay, I'm I'm trying to go in there. 
friends of yours? I've had run-ins with those guys before. They don't like strangers, even nice guys like me. I'm shocked. I'm pulling your chain, darling. You want to go and say hello? It's your funeral. Those guns aren't for show. Someone should be doing something. They are. It's called surviving. Everyone's turning on each other. The fear, it makes people crazy. I've noticed. Yeah, what a weird thing for you to say. You've been living here? What can I say? My butler's on holiday. Grab what you need. You don't know when you'll get another chance. Been now let's just save. Now, waiting for a ship. Waiting for you, I guess. It can get pretty dark around here. You should take that flashlight over there. Make sure you're stocked up on batteries. A bunch of just junk on the floor. <clears throat> some of it I can interact with, some of it I can't. Just be careful not to flash it around. We don't want to get caught. Let's go. Okay, so the headset was the flashlight. Turn that off. This way. What now? I'll watch the vent. There's another vent right here somewhere. I marked it so I wouldn't forget it. How about you look around? You're not going anywhere until you find that vent. Okay. <laughs> what that was about. I was pushing it over and over again. Guess that's not the vent. you're looking for Excellent. I guess this Is one it? hold on I'm coming <laughs> all the closed vents are the all the open vents I couldn't interact with but this one I found that's closed I knew it was here somewhere see got it covered Again, I'm over 45 minutes in and I haven't even seen one alien yet. Much slower burn. But it's given me a chance to kind of get to the feel of the game. As opposed to just immediately killing me over and over again. You're the one who's going slow. Is this the way everyone travels around here? Just those that want to stay alive, sweetheart. Oh, God. I hope this character dies soon. I am really tired of being Toys, called sweetheart. So that's your ship, huh? Quiet. I hear something. Yeah, I hear you. Will do. Again, you're the one who keeps talking. Gotta go meet the others. Something's going down. There's always something going down. Come on. We don't want to piss him off. You feel safe? I sure as hell don't. Follow me. Oh, good. Crazy guy's gonna do something crazy. Okay, go be quiet here. Don't shine that flashlight. Hold up. Hey, we can What's the emergency? Something. Someone else has been here. Everyone, stay alert. Keep your guns tight. Shoot anyone you don't know. 
Stick around while I check our stock. <coughs> Too many of them to take on. Take on? We still got to get through there. The door at the end. How? I'll try a distraction. The generator. That way third. You have to check it out. The smaller the thing, the easier to distract. Great. Which one of you checked our supplies last? I did. What's up? You decide to help yourself a little? What the fuck is that supposed to mean? Hey, he's been with me the whole time. We're missing food, ammo, meds. If it's not one of us, then we were right. Someone's been in here. This is no good. We're supposed to be secure down here. Damn it. What about the lock Joe rigged up? I've just come from there. Sealed tight. Eyes open. Keep your guns ready. Someone's gonna have to tell the boss. Bo what just happened? The generators died. Wait. Thought I heard something. They actually want to be quiet, as though they could really hear me. Let's keep it down. They're still close by. Nice work, Ripley. This way. Follow me. Oh good, another save point. How much further? Nearly there. Transit is just up ahead. Let's just hope your ship's still there. Is it terminal? Sevastopol, not quite what you're expecting, eh? I'm not even supposed to be here. My shipping out papers were for a week ago. So, two days to retirement, huh? You really don't have much long to live. It's funny, every now and then I see a prompt on the screen. Okay. You gotta be more careful of that. There's no reticule on the screen, so it's it's a little more immersive, but at the same time, it's it means I'm, I'm more likely to miss things because I don't know exactly what I'm looking at. Got it. We need to activate both consoles at the same time to open it. I'll do this one. You go to the one on the other side. Okay. Ready. On three. One, two, three. Axel, behind you. What? How could you have even heard Fuck me from way over here? Get here now. I've got the thieving son of a bitch. You bums think you could take what you. <laughs> are on their way. We need to go! No! Hey, you bastards! Move it! Shoot him! Shit, I think he's dead. They killed him. Come on! Okay, cutscene time, I guess. You killed that guy! Because he was going to kill me, you saved my life. This is about survival. Understand. We are not far enough away to be having this conversation. I hear something. Axel. What have I got on me?
What the hell was that thing? Gotta keep moving. Alright, so we did finally see our first xenomorph. At least, kind of, see our first xenomorph. And it was about an hour in. So I don't know if this is essentially the end of the tutorial, if uh, the alien can, can get me if I just stand around long enough, or what. Man, this is taking forever to get here. Is it coming? It's not very subtle, is it? Alright, well, I guess that's a good place to... to stop it then. Again, we got about an hour into the game before we even came into contact with our first Xenomorph, which was a nice change of pace. I, I definitely appreciate the slow burn the letting you get to be enveloped in the atmosphere and the characters and the setting, the control, letting you understand what the stakes are. Just so much better storytelling and craftsmanship in this game. And I really I really enjoyed it. I, I liked how it's it's tense and it's getting more tense. And the fact that it's not, again, just a singular threat. It won't just be the Xenomorph that will be causing problems, but also the survivors on the ship that are all turning on each other and will be posing an even greater threat. So once again, guys, this was Alien Isolation on the PS4. I hope you enjoyed it. Have a good one.